I mean, blocks, U-bolts, the whole axle's been powder coated. Stage four cammed monster truck. Damn, that turned out good. Real shit, this is starting to get annoying. And it's, I'm not even like joking anymore. So I'm cruising on my way to work, you know, pulling around this bend, about to go into, you know, I'm like maybe a mile from my job. And I see this cop sitting over there and there's nobody, like nobody around, nobody around coming around this curb. And I see this uh, Henry County or GHP, GSP, whatever the fuck it is, over on the left. And I'm minding my own business. I'm not speeding, I'm not doing anything. And as soon as I get by him, as soon as I start to turn the curve, he'd been sitting in the same spot, you could tell. His lights come on, not the, the top lights, but his headlights come on, his brake lights, and he pulls out. And I'm like, you gotta be, you gotta be fucking kidding me. So, I real quick, instincts, pulled into the next complex, and I'm like way back here in the back parking lot, because I, I knew he was turning right behind, nuh-uh, nuh-uh, not today. Today's Friday. It's Christina's birthday. I'm not playing these games today. I'm not playing these games today. So, started my day off running from the cops. <laughs> Getting off a little early today. It is Christina's birthday. So y'all drop some comments below for Christina's birthday. What the hell's going on out here? So we're gonna be finishing up this FTS kit today. We got some 26 inch rep, reps, reps going on this. Not replicas, reps going on this it's gonna turn out that's gonna turn out i'm excited to see that one I'm, I'm actually really excited to see that one hopefully they at least get the wheels on it before i leave today uh i don't know what the hell this jeep is to be honest that, that thing's kind of a that's that that's got a lot going on and then i got nick grizz coming up here today bringing me his truck up here to the shop which i'm pretty excited about I ain't seen my boy in a minute he's got some new stuff done to his truck so uh, you guys will probably end up seeing a couple of clips of that as well so we got, and you know, like I said, Christina's birthday today, so some stuff this afternoon. A lot going on today, a lot, a lot, a lot to get done, but I'm excited. You know we accept the challenge, you know we never accept defeat, and we like to get this bread while we're doing it. Got something in my shoe. What the hell's going on? Oh my God. Yeah. Is that Nick Grizz? Yeah, we got no brakes, no alignment. No brakes. You're you're exposing yourself, man. Yeah, look at this, look at this custom hey, this work. From a frame and a body <laughs> to a running truck in fucking two days. Yeah. Look at this custom work, man. You know, I first of all, what what color is this? Illusion money. Damn. Yeah, we still gotta put the traction bars on, but we just did not have time. Damn. Oh, so you've upgraded a lot of stuff. Everything. Yep. Everything Kryptonite uh, offers, I have. Damn. Damn. Ooh. I like this. So are, are y'all going to Daytona? Yeah. Or so try, as trying as to? As soon as, as soon as you know, y'all finish my truck. Uh, I, are you putting the bumper on it? I need on it. Yeah, the bumper's up. Uh, Bumper than uh, our British bed. It's uh, the your style bumper. Oh. We're gonna fucking fab that up tonight. And and they said the holy shit. Yeah, they look said at the this. Powder coat wouldn't fucking uh, wouldn't burn on those. That's why I did them, and they fucking burn. Oh, so they were all green? Yeah. Yeah, they were they were the same colors as everything else. And they said they wouldn't burn, but. <laughs> it is, so I'm just gonna Are these new tips? Yeah, I'm just gonna paint them black. Yeah, they're six inches. Six inch tips. Damn. That color is beautiful. I know, right? It's crazy. That Daytona crunch going on. You know, some of us got to stay behind and shit on the rest of them that are left behind. You know, we can't all go to Daytona and be cool, you know? Hey, you can definitely go. I'm, <laughs> I'm in the bag. We don't have to make a the room. Damn. I love that. That looks so good. Oh, mm, man. Five, five thirteen gears. Holy shit! So, so I'm like twenty miles an hour off. We were going eighty. I was going eighty-five, and I was like, "Hey, Wyatt, how fast are we going?" Because I was getting passed by semis, 
and it's like 62. Yep. And I'm like, ugh. <laughs> so I'm freaking picking that thing at 100 miles an hour going 70. So it's, it's the same thing that happens with my truck. Um, sorry. A lot, so a lot of people don't know. Um, so the new body style trucks, they um, the speedometer stops at 100 right yeah so and i never got rid of that uh governor that's on the truck so my Ooh. truck can't go over 80 miles an hour so anytime i do rollers or ride down the highway so like when i was going to augusta with y'all uh, that's why i was so slow i can't go over like 80 miles an hour or like 84. so you can i'm sure your your speedometer I, probably uh, go to i hit my speedometer goes to 120 and i was going 130 last, last night. night yeah i wasn't pegged out i can still no, go no, no. Speedometer. oh yeah for the because my my uh, uh cruise control it stops at 98 so i put it at 98 and i was going fucking 70 miles an hour the whole way home but i mean this keeps me from speeding though yeah i've been getting bothered by cops so much recently it's it's been, ever ever since that meet that you're like oh, it's been I run so every ever, ever since that meet it's like, been so not, annoying this morning i almost got pulled over i had to like run from the guy and like pull into a place <laughs> Um, last night I was on the way home and somebody got pulled over right next to me and it freaked me out. I thought I was getting pulled over. It's, it's been bad. It's been bad. But hey, we're, we're going to get you in here. We're going to get you taken care of. That beautiful ass color, man. You know, last last time I did a video on your truck, it did like hella views. So they need to show some love. Show some love to my guy. At this point, Nick's truck has turned into a full frame off Daytona build, which is really, really cool that I get to be a part of this process, even just by a little bit. So Nick has dropped this truck off really just to get the alignment done today. And even just such a small piece like an alignment is really big on a, on a truck like this. So Nick over the last week has, has just about, uh, from what he said, has taken every every piece of suspension from underneath this truck, axles, all of it. The entire suspension has come out. Everything has been repowder coated. This Illusion Money color, which you guys have seen on the channel one other time. It's a beautiful, beautiful color, but it matches up with Nick's color scheme absolutely perfectly. So Nick has got this uh, 05 2500 stage four cammed, just monster truck with all of this Illusion Money green powder coated suspension, brand new everything top to bottom we got the dual reservoir fox shocks up top all kryptonite tie rods upper control arms we got new lower control arms cv axles hubs tie rods uh, i think i already said that i mean everything everything's been redone wheel lights all of it i mean this truck is absolutely beautiful i love this green color i think everything has turned out great nick you got a great truck here it's, it's loud as hell too this truck is so damn loud it makes no sense but obviously that stage four cam with the straight piped exhaust i'm assuming i mean really makes perfect sense all he's got to do today is throw the the bumper back on it and get riding out like you guys had seen earlier but man this thing's crazy a whole bunch of sponsors we got southern kings longhorn fab tech overkill fab jam handle bolt lock fuel forged yeah i mean you can't forget about the fuel forged 24 by 16 fuel forged with the uh, Illusion Money spike lug nuts. Super cool. You got even, what, powder coated calipers, rotors. I mean, blocks, U-bolts, the whole axle's been powder coated. The drive shaft's been powder coated. Every piece of this truck has been gone through. And they even tried to powder coat the tips too. <laughs> I mean, this thing is just crazy. I love this, this, uh, this bodyguard bumper up here with the dual, what is it, probably like 32 inch, 32 inch lights. All of these change colors too. He doesn't have them on because he's not here, but these all change colors to green. He's got green wheel lights, green rock lights. I mean, the whole truck's been gone through. He's got a full interior sound system going into it right now. It's not finished up, so I'm not gonna show you yet. But Daytona Crunch is real around here. Like I said, like I've said in the last couple of videos, even though I'm not going to Daytona, I'm I'm really happy that I can be a part of some of you, some of your process to get to Daytona. So today is Friday. It's Friday morning about 11 o'clock. This truck's going to leave here today and he's on the way to Daytona to be at the show either tonight or first thing in the morning. So super cool that we can get you in and out this quick. You know, you know, fingers crossed as long as everything goes well. Um, but hey, it's Nick. It's a beautiful truck. Super nice guy. Doesn't get any better than that. Daytona Crunch 2021. The first set. 
I've never seen these before. Oh, after you. After you. That piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, that thing's nice. How much fun is it gonna be that you're a camera guy now? Well, I've always wanted to be the guy behind the camera because... See, now you get to be a part of every clip now. I got somebody to joke with behind the camera now and not just laughing. But I'm only gonna film vehicles that I like. This is actually my favorite vehicle that I've ever done. <laughs> it's got a 26 by 14 tough T somethings, uh, 37 T2Bs. inch gladiators. T2 Bs. Come on now. There's gonna be an upgrade coming soon, guys, because look at this shit. I mean, God, they're wore out. It's crazy shit. I haven't even rotated these. Look at this. I remember my first. Oh, there's the guy. I haven't rotated my shoes either. Yeah, you fucking wearing steel toe boots behind the desk. I That's didn't. Cool. I, I'd never seen these in person actually. 75, 40, 24, I ain't gonna lie, it's probably the best truck we've never done. Best truck we've never done. Purple McGoy's kit without the emblem on it. Coming That's soon. If if I had to if I had to guess, we're probably doing alignment on this. I'll be honest, this is exactly what I wanted to do is I wanted to take and put Southern Tire and Billet right there where the logo goes. Is that what you see Yeah, serious. I've been doing that forever. I just can't really find a guy to do it. Your finger's right on top of the microphone. You gotta be careful. The microphone's right in the middle. Right. right there. Where's the microphone at? That purple McGoy's lip kit. Can you show me where it's at again? <laughs> I like these though. American Trucks wheels. You got the, the color matched spike lugs. With the 375 Toyos, I do have to tell you though, I like the Nittos better, 100%. Not because I'm a Nitto guy. Hey, shout out Nitto pit crew on that one. Um, Nittos have a more square look. I like that better, personally. Toyos are cool too though, All right? Fat. Fat, P-H-A-T-T, -T. fat. Fat boy. To be real honest, I love the way it looks, but it might've been a little bit too fat for this fender flare. Oh, they cut a lot off of that. Oh, yeah. Whoever did that cut a lot. I don't know who this, whose truck this is. Love the look. Holy shit. That's, That'll happen. That's before they cut, I'm sure. That's what we call collateral damage. That's before they cut. There's a thing called natural fender trimming. You don't cut anything. You just let... You just, it, it just eats what it don't yep. want. <laughs> It'll just do. Eventually, it won't scrub anymore. <laughs> It looks good though. Stop looking at my ass. It's kind of weird. I was actually filming the Tahoe. It looks way better. Get out of my picture, buddy. <laughs> Hot as shit. Put this hoodie on. What's wrong with me? It's fucking June, buddy. <laughs> All right. Just kidding. I'm not doing that here. <laughs> <laughs> Got your boy Snoop on six is up here in the cut today. Camera fogging up. Gotta love it, man. There you go. Y'all remember these wheels. 26 by 16 KG1 Snows. Things are beautiful. Tahoe turned out great. Come on, man, really? What the hell are we fogging up for? I'll go show some love to my guy, Snoop on Sixes. And things turned out good. I need some six. I'm, I'm definitely, definitely leaning towards 16 wides when I do mine next. But I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Let me wiping off the camera every five seconds, huh? Damn, that turned out good. I love that. Them boys going riding today. Jay Ford in the flesh. Man, you need to clean this damn truck. It's been raining like crazy up here in Georgia, Georgia the last couple of days, though. Man, I want to go riding. 
I've been thinking about getting me like a little four wheeler or something to start fucking around with. I don't know. I tell you what, I'm gonna start messing with the cat eye next week though, for real. I'm getting back on the cat eye. They done throwing a bunch of trash in the back of it. All kinds of shit. I'm gonna start drive I'm gonna drive it all next week. Get some get some new speakers put in. I'm gonna start messing with that some more next week. So y'all y'all stay tuned for that. I'm excited. Switch back and forth between my two builds in the Tahoe. J Ford out here looking. I'm telling you, even even though the wheels are dirty, they still look good. Shining up good. My man Hellboy in the flesh. That truck always looks clean. One of the best trucks we've built up here. 100 percent But for real, y'all think I should get like a four wheeler or something? A little side by side, something to mess around with. I'm really thinking about it. Let me know what you guys think. This is this is what I've come to. This is what I've come to decide. I need to hire a cameraman. Are you listening? I'm listening. You're not even listening. I'm listening. I got you on camera, not listening. I'm listening. I need to hire a camera guy. How much better would the content be if I didn't have to film it? You could we could just get the candid moments. We could get the the non you know the non-scripted well we don't script anything but you know when we hold the camera we know what we're going to say when we're going to talk but if somebody else is filming we're not paying attention we're getting just the raw just natural content I can be your camera guy. you know there is a channel that i watch his that's not what i'm saying his wife is his camera lady camera guy i need a camera guy just start fill just start picking up my camera and filming me all the time it's filming right now Give the people what they want to see, though. <laughs> I wouldn't. I mean, you know what I'm saying? They've probably seen enough of you, I would think. So what I would do from this point on. the last point. video. This is who they want to see. Look at that. Leonard, call me a beautiful little peacock. All right. <laughs> All right. Another episode of uh, Southern Tire. This is done by... Thank you for calling Taco Bell. This is Alex. How can I help you? All right, so we're going to go ahead and call me that wider bow tie because my Tahoe is about a quarter of an inch, or her Tahoe is about a quarter of an inch wider than the uh, <laughs> the old classic 14 model outside. I'm letting you know right now, anything you film on my camera goes on YouTube. Oh, God. <laughs> Beat that out. <laughs> what up, dude? <laughs> Saw it, dude. Don't look at it. Are you looking at this swag right now? Is that what you're looking at? Looking at this swag? Fucking pin necklace? I don't, uh... Two pins? That's like my outfit though, usually. Outside of work. Like I wear the Sperry's like that. Me too, that's why I'm wearing them. But I wear them at work. Well guys, it's the last day you're ever gonna see the bow tie. It's getting scrapped. No one plan. <laughs> I got a buddy that builds three wheelers. Like three wheelers. Really? They're dangerous. I just don't want a banshee. <laughs> I don't know why, I want, I want something. You think you're faster than me? You think it's you think you're faster than me? No. No. In the spare room.